A lot of people wondering this morning if everyone will need to wear masks again like this while traveling just days after a judge overturned the CDC's federal mask mandate. The question is coming after the Justice Department just filed an appeal to fight that judge's ruling. ABC 10 News reporter Natay Holmes explains what this new appeal means if you're planning to travel soon. The White House says the reason for the appeal is for the CDC to have the authority to make decisions on the current and future health crisis. But for travelers right now, masking rules on public transportation remains inconsistent. Well, it's really quite confusing. I think it's really important that they actually appeal that uh, the ruling because I think it is important that we are able to switch back to putting masks again if there's another big variant. Many doctors and public health officials are also speaking out against the mask reversal. The CDC's concern goes beyond this mandate, which was set to expire May 3rd. They want to have the authority to put masks back on in the future in case of another surge. According to Health and Human Services, new infection rates have grown by nearly 23% in the last week. 36 states and territories have seen an increase of about 10% or more in that same time. And hospital admissions are up too. A mask are not required on flights, but you may need to put one on inside of the airport, depending on which city you land in. At the San Diego International Airport, Nate Holmes, ABC 10 News.